So your new book is called Going Into Town, yes. A Love Letter to New York. What inspired you to write it? It was inspired by a booklet that I had written for my daughter when she went off to college um, and several years ago. And uh, she went to School of Visual Arts and we live up here in Connecticut. And we had taken many trips into the city together. Uh, but, you know, the same way it is when you're a passenger in a car, you don't always take in directions. And I said, well, you know, Manhattan is pretty much, it's very easy to get around. It's laid out like a grid, most of it. And she said, what do you mean? So I got a piece of paper and I'm saying, okay, these are the avenues, these are the streets. So if you want to go from like 43rd Street up to 44th Street, you walk uptown four blocks. And she actually said to me, what's a block? <laughs> <laughs> and, um, you know, because we don't really refer to blocks mm -hmm. out here. You know, there are little pieces of sidewalks, but it's not all over. And, uh, you know, so I thought, well, okay, we have a little work to do here. And then I sort of forgot about it. And at the end of four years, she gave it back to me. And she said, Mom, this was really helpful. Thank you. And I could see it had been used. I thought, well, you know, I'm going to just send this to uh, my agent and say, you know, do you like this? Do you think this is, you know, a book? And um, she liked it a lot. And then as I started writing it, it was that, but then it became other things as well. And, you know, I wanted to talk about how much I love really love New York. And why do you like love New York so much? Oh, there's like a million billion reasons. Um, I think for one thing, it's where I grew up, so it feels very much like my hometown. And uh, I mean, I was not a happy kid. I was not happy. I was very unhappy in high school. I wasn't, you know, I, I had a lot of worries in college. There were, it was, you know, and Manhattan, when I moved to Manhattan when I was 23, it was like that's when I started to feel like I was home. New York was really like, there's people like me here, mm -hmm. you know? Right. Well, Roz Chas, thanks very much for talking to Shelf Life. Well, thank you. <laughs>